everyone welcome to our channel in today's video i am going to show you how to run single postman request multiple times okay here we have a two scenarios one scenario is running same request multiple times with same set of data second scenario is running same single request multiple times with different set of data okay i will show you both of them in this video first let me explain you about the request here the request is login request for which i am providing email and password data in the body section and then i have created four scripts test scripts in the test tab okay which are written in javascript and are run after the response is received okay now let me show you how to run this request multiple times with the same set of data first and then i will show you running the same login request multiple times with different set of data if you want to run the re request for only one time you can simply click on send but if you want to run multiple times i will show you how to do that okay before that what we have to do is we should cr create a collection and then add your request to that collection which you want to run multiple times okay for this demo i have created a demo collection and then i have added my login request to that collection now the thing is you have to click on three dots next to the collection and then select the option that is run collection after selecting that option specify the number of iterations you want to run let me keep five iterations for this demo and then if you want to keep delay between each iteration you can specify here specify two milliseconds for this demo if you want to save the responses of request enable this option if you want to update or if you want to write the value of variables at the end of the run to its current value enable this option if you want to run collection without using stored cookies enable this option if you want to update the cookies stored in this session stored in this session and then save them to your cookie manager enable this option okay now once we are done with all of this just click on run demo that is run and then collection name here demo is a collection name okay simply click on this and if you see here this request that is login request ran for five times first iteration second iteration third iteration fourth iteration and then fifth iteration in each iteration once login request completed all of the there is four test scripts ran four test scripts ran there is total 20 five iterations four test scripts there is 20 you want to see the results complete results click on view results here you can check the first iteration the login request and then which is completed successfully took 115 milliseconds and then ran for test scripts after response is received okay in the similar way iteration 2 iteration 3 iteration 4 and then iteration 5 this is about running same single request multiple times with same set of data if you see here we haven't changed this data we are using same email password five times in the execution okay five times in the execution now let's say if you want to run this login request with different set of data multiple times then how to do is just go here or else close this then select again run collection here if you see we have a option to select a file so for that what we have to do is we should prepare data file first that is postman supports two formats csv and then json format i will show you csv first and then i will show you json format okay for that we have to prepare a data file first let me show you how to prepare a data file here if you see this is a csv format i have already prepared a data file for this here we should mention the variables which we are using in our request 
if you check the request in the body section these are the variables email and then password okay that is the reason i am using the same variable names here after that we should provide the data sets so here i am using total four data sets that is four different emails and then password combinations this is about csv format now let me save this and then show you running the request multiple times with different set of data let's go to postman and then go to collection runner here you see here iteration is default is one iteration is one now let me select the file click on select file and then select the file that is csv file and open you see here number of iterations changed when we selected the file and then even you can preview what is the data which we are going to run against okay if you see here this is the data first iteration this is the data second iteration this is the data third iteration this is the data okay now let me run it select the options as i said earlier and then click on if you want to keep delay you can keep delay as well let me keep three and then run demo okay now it ran successfully that is the same request same request that is login request ran multiple times that is four times with different set of data if you, if you want to check that you can check here just click on this and then if you see here request body email is user2 at the gmail.com let's go to the second iteration click on here and then request body if you see here okay body why it is always two oh yeah i got it now we forgot to update the see the thing is we are using data file right so when you use data file we should use placeholders for that variables inside data file if you see the variables are email and then password if i want to use uh, replace those with these uh, values i should use placeholders in the request body for that what i can do is let me come here and then put this email and then password okay let me save this now go to collection runner and then run again okay run again now if you see click on login go to request body here it is user 2 now go to here you see here the request body email is user 3 go to first iteration you see here request body here it is user 1 okay in this way our single request ran multiple times with different set of data this is about using csv format now let me show you how to run same request multiple times using json data format now let me show you the json file format first and then we can select that file if you see here this is the json format same as csv format we should mention the email and password in different objects this is these are the json objects okay here i i provided four json objects to run my request four times against this data okay now let me show you running our request using this json file format select that and then click on here again same way we can do the preview what all data we are going to run okay after that just select this select and then run demo let's check whether different data is used or not click on here go to request body See here in the first request it used user one okay in the second request it used user two okay in the third request it used user three okay in the similar way in the fourth request used user four okay this is about running single request multiple times same set of data and different set of data this is very useful if you want to run same request multiple times 
based on your requirement okay that's it for today's video thanks for watching if you like the video please do subscribe and hit like and bell icon thanks again if you have anything please drop in comments or if you want any specific topic from postman please let me know in the comments thanks again i will see you in the next video